How to maintain health, beloved, I wish above all things that thou mayest prosper and be in health, even as thy soul prospereth. 3 John 1 verse 2 Now therefore beware, I pray thee, and drink not wine nor strong drink, and eat not any unclean, Judge 13 colon 4. Open with a heartfelt welcome. Hello, and welcome. Today we're exploring a topic that affects us all, health. As the ancient wisdom of 3 John 1 verse 2 reminds us, our well-being is deeply connected to our spirit's prosperity. Then, set the stage. In our fast-paced modern world, maintaining health can seem like a daunting task. But it's not as complicated as you might think. It's about making wise choices for our bodies, our minds, and our spirits. Next, delve into the first principle. First, let's talk about nutrition. The Bible warns against overindulging in wine and unclean foods. But what does that mean for us today? It's about balance and mindful eating. Choose fresh, whole foods, and drink in moderation. Now, transition to the next point. But health isn't just about what we consume. It's also about what we do. Regular exercise is vital. It keeps our bodies strong and our minds clear. But remember, it's not about punishing your body. It's about celebrating what it can do. Then, bring the focus to mental health. Our mind and spirit also need nourishment. This means taking time for rest, reflection, and connection. This can be prayer, meditation, or simply time spent in nature. Remember, a healthy mind leads to a healthy body. Now, introduce another aspect. Health is also about the company we keep. Surround yourself with people who uplift you, challenge you, and make you want to be better. Toxic relationships can harm our health just as much as poor nutrition or lack of exercise. Next, discuss the importance of regular checkups. Don't forget to get regular checkups. Early detection is key for many health issues. This includes mental health. Don't hesitate to seek professional help if you're feeling overwhelmed, anxious, or depressed. Now, transition to the conclusion. As we journey towards better health, remember that it's not about perfection. It's about progress. It's about making small, sustainable changes that add up over time. Finally, end with a motivational message. So, in the spirit of 3 John 1 verse 2, let's strive to prosper and be in health, just as our soul prospers. Let's make choices that nourish our bodies, our minds, and our spirits. Let's live a life of balance, wisdom, and wellness. With a warm farewell, conclude the video. Thank you for joining us on this journey towards better health. Remember, your health is your wealth. Take care of it, cherish it, and it will serve you well. Until next time, be well and prosper.